Hey everybody, it's Mr. Spencer Prime, and today I am doing another video review, this time of the Transformers Revenge of the Fallen Deluxe Class Wheelie. So, first of all, this, I know, I just don't have that many new figures, you know, uh, I don't know if you guys want a review, want a review of, uh, Voyager class Dark of the Moon Ironhide. I might do him next weekend. Um so probably look out for that. But um other than Wheelie in this review, I have my buddy that I got yesterday at Walmart, which is as I think Big Brother Angry Bird or something. Yeah, the big red one. I don't know what you call him, but he's gonna be sitting in the background just because he's awesome. So he's gonna be watching the camera to see if you guys have bad behavior. Okay, hold on. Just need to fix him in there. Oh. So, anyway, on to the new game. This guy is, as you probably know if you saw the movie, an RC truck. You know, like an RC monster truck, you know. Nice wheels. They have some texture on them, that's why I make that noise. Yeah. And then, you know, it actually is a very nice, flat, you know, pickup truck, monster truck, whatever you want to call it. Um, you know, he has actually a bed, but, ooh, it's an extending back instead of just a flipping back. Anyway, um, and then he does have blue headlights here, blue top light for doing it um, I, I, I don't think you guys can see that there, but, no color here, just gray plastic, you know, all headlights here, you know, nice stuff, uh, two headlights here. And here, and then there's a grill right there. But, you know, this is pretty good detail for a deluxe class. And if you actually put him in robot mode and you put his legs straight, you know, he actually is a Voyager class size in robot mode if you put his legs straight. But, you know, he does have some nice tinted windows. Um, kind of gray, as you can see. But, anyway, on to the transformate. Oh, okay. I don't think you guys can see this, but there is a stress mark right here. Very teeny, not that important, but sometime it might get important. Uh, there's this one part of the transformation that goes from robot to vehicle that kind of, I do it kind of wrong, I guess. So I got some stress marks on there, so I'm going to be trying be careful with them. Anyway, as I said, on to the transformation. Let me just fix the camera. My camera is still on low, not low battery power, just the tripod. But anyway, okay. So, what you want to do first, I haven't transformed this guy in a long time. I'm going to try to memorize everything. Pull his head. Just like that. Then you want to take this part, fold out his legs, uh, then you have him like that. What next do you do? Okay, then you want to take this, split it, split, oh gosh, I really hate that. I really hate that. Okay, wow, pretty easy fix. Um, so now that you're done with that part, you want to just take this, the doors, and just kind of, oh, no, 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 you want to take this part, pull it up, then, you have them like that, then you split these doors up like that, kind of weird, um, but, uh, then you take his head, and 
Now, we have him like that. Hold his mouth down. It's kind of weird like that. I'm gonna fix his head later. Um, you wanna take these weak parts and split them. So then, once you, so when you split them, th these side parts they will fold into the middle. Ah, uh, there. Oh, okay, guys. You have to keep his head up like that. Then you can fold them in easily. Uh, then. Once you've done that, you want to take these wheel parts. Nope. Oh, no, 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 no. You want to take this part. You know the part that formed the cab. Just flip it up and split it in half. I don't think it tabs in anywhere. Uh, maybe right there, but, you know. Then you just take his arms, rotate them like that, you know. Uh... Then you just extend his arms, fix them like that, all you want. Uh, same thing. Same thing hands. Um, just to fix the hands. Okay. There. Now I guess you leave these doors like this. Uh, yeah, probably. Then just take these. Um, I think just leave them like this, I guess, uh, or you leave them like that. Probably we'll just do for the sake of the review, do it the right way. So just fold his legs up like that, not like so they're like teen like really teeny like transforming him into vehicle mode but you know just little wise uh, so then you just flip out his kind of thing to stabilize and to stand position his kneecaps any way you want I'm probably gonna leave mine just like that then just make him stand up see guys this is really hard to make him stand because Oh! Wow! Okay. That was good. Not as hard as it used to be. When I got this figure, it took me like five minutes to make him stand up, and I was so frustrated. Okay. Okay. Then you'll just want to take his head, and then just flip the eyes however you want. Probably gonna make him look like he's mad like it when he looks mad. Um, I really don't like these feet, guys. Uh, they're kind of hard to make them stand, as I said before. Um, he doesn't really have any feet, they're just like two pegs. No. Help him stand. There we go. So then you have Transformers Revenge of the Fallen Deluxe Class Wheelie in robot mode. So, very nice robot mode. Um, probably gonna position him sideways so you can kind of see him. Like that. Mm, yeah, no side to side. I'm just gonna hold him like this, but uh, articulation-wise, uh, his arms go 360. His arms have a lot of things here. Uh, they rotate 360 at the elbow. They uh, bend 90 degrees at the elbow. And then all of his fingers are individually articulated. But he does have some really nice details here, as you can see. You know, it's nice. I don't know. But, um, legs articulation, they go forward. Oh, no, forward, back. Um, they go out at two points. Uh, let's see. Okay, you can see it easily. Out like that, and up and out like that. Kind of weird, but... Uh, he does bend like that at the knee. You know, like that. Two points. One there that's really loose, and one there that's not so loose. Maybe... Nah, I don't think you can fix that. Um, sorry for all the, the door slamming, you know. Just, uh, 
if you can hear that. I don't know if you guys can hear that. This camera doesn't have the best audio, but anyway, put pivot. Not really. Nah. Uh, yeah. Kind of sucks. But I mean, anyway, you guys probably know the gimmick. You know, in the movie, I reach anything like this to called to Autobot. You just take this. See how there's a. There, that's just the other one. When you turn this this way, turn to the there. Um, so you know that's oh, head articulation. I don't know if I did this. You know the eyes do all that junk. They do that. No, 360 or anything. Not even side to side. Um, and then it bends here at the neck, which is kind of weird. And here at the neck. Sick. Sick. Ooh, sick. What? What? Uh, just... So, guys, that's pretty much it for this little review of this guy that can't stand. Really kind of pisses me off, but he's gonna be, like, swaying like that. Um, but... So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, and just to finish him off, I love this figure, but I'm going to pretend that he's the pig in Angry Birds World. So, don't make him mad, or he will hit you. Thanks for watching, guys.